right, so this is a review of the Quaba tricycle. It's on Amazon right now for $55. It had a 5% coupon on it. Um, it had a four and a half star review out of 126 reviews, but I couldn't find any videos on it when I lo was looking for a little bit more detail, so I decided to make one. Um, it's pretty cool. I just put it together. I'll do my unboxing. I'll show, my, show you my little guy on it riding around. It's got the EVA wheels on it, which I was a little concerned about at first. I really wanted to get some nice heavy duty rubber ones, but I figured this is the same type of wheel that the Strider bike uses, so I figured it's okay for that. It should be okay for this. Um, it's got a steel frame, and but it does have uh, plastic connectors in some parts. The only part that really makes me a little nervous is down here where you connect the steel frame to the wheel assembly. It is plastic, so hopefully that's not really a big deal. It's nice and sturdy, but it is plastic. Um, anyways, it's got a nice rugged look. The seat is adjustable. That was a big deal for me. Um, it's about 9.9 .9 pounds, so it's pretty light. It's really easy to move. It's got a little handle on the seat. It's pretty awesome. I also have a video on assembly, so that's coming up soon. It took me all said maybe a little under 30 minutes to assemble, so not too terribly long. Um, it's 29 inches long by 19 inches wide. So, all right, let's uh, let's get to it. All right, guys, here's the box. I'm gonna go over and unbox it for you. And then I'm gonna take a look at the instructions, figure out what I need, and I'll tell you how long it takes me to put it together. So let's go. I have a special tool, so I might not even need any more tools. So that's kind of cool. Okay. All right. Panel bars. It's got a little plastic protector. And that's it, guys. All right, let's see how long it takes me to put it together. do a quick little video of the instructions because I know it's a huge thing with people sometimes but I've got this the first page is English and that is pretty much it because then we go straight into the other language so, all right guys I'll let you know how this goes rear wheels and it's because it comes with this on and it is on there nice and tight like it's not something that just this little piece of foam you wouldn't think it would belong there but when you try to yank on it it, it definitely is stuck on there really good so it makes you think maybe it's supposed to be there there is a button and just goofing off with the back wheels so anyway figured it out you have to pull these off really really hard like very very hard like I'm struggling it with it behind the camera and then it finally comes off and that makes much more sense. So anyways. All right guys, well here they are side by side. The reason I bought the new tricycle was because I accidentally backed into our old radio flyer and the tires messed up, but 
But anyways, my two and a half year old couldn't really touch the pedals anyway, so I decided to get him something new and something with an adjustable seat. That's kind of what led me to this one. It's got two, two sets of bolts that you can move it back. Um, I guess the next position's probably about an inch and a half or so back behind that, so it's kind of nice. Um, fairly easy to put together. I, uh, the instructions are not that good, but it's really, there's really not a lot to it, so you just gotta fiddle with it for a minute. Um, I didn't screw in the, the fender, the fender screw under there, so I had to go back at the end and redo that, and, um, man, the tires in the back, they're super easy to put on, but the, the little foam pads just didn't look like they were supposed to come off, but, but anyways, um, my little guy's at school, so when he gets home, I'll show it to him and see how he likes it, see how, how it drives. Um, but I definitely think he'll be able to touch the pedals on this one compared to the old Radio Flyer one. So, we'll see. Okay, can you hop on? Yeah. Can you touch those pedals? Can you reach it? Can you push? <gasps> push, push, push. I know we got a hill, but push. Alright, so this is my five and a half year old on it. Obviously he's big, but my little two and a half year old is, um, he can reach the pedals. He's not really used to riding tricycles. He has a balance bike. So we just gotta get him used to, used to riding it a little bit. But what do you think? Good. Can you go down, go down the hill a little bit? Yeah. Okay, make a circle and then go down. Alright, go straight down. Ben's gonna do okay on that? Yeah. All right, so we're back out here for the second time. I got him on a little bit more of a flat surface. I also measured him. He's, uh, he's about 36 inches tall and has about a 13 inch inseam. Um, and weight wise, he's about 30, maybe 31 pounds, but. <laughs> so um, he can reach the pedals. He uh, can't really reach him too well turning because your foot kind of pulls away a little bit. So we do have a little bit more time to grow into it before he's uh, got a good push off and gets a good pedal rhythm going. Um, other than that, um, pretty cool. We like it. My five-year-old likes it just fine. And uh, that's really it. Thanks so much for watching and uh, I appreciate it.